I'm mindful we are gathered here today for a great celebration of uh, christening of uh, Joshua only. So this is a great day. Amen, church? Yeah. Let me welcome you all. For those who have not been to, uh, to Asbury, this is Asbury United Methodist Church. Uh, in our community brand wine and I want to warmly welcome you on behalf of the church um, and uh, for those who have been here before uh, this is your place so we thank God that you are here this morning at this moment I want to welcome our uh, certified minister minister Perel Chase who is with us who has come to bless uh, Josiah so at this moment Let's prepare our hearts and our minds and our lives to be in prayer. But maybe before you start, let me do something that I feel the Holy Spirit is leading me to do, which is because it's a joyful day. This is the day, this is the day that the Lord has made, that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice, let us rejoice and be glad in it, and be glad in it. This is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. This is the day, this is the day that the Lord has made. Amen. Amen. Over to you, Minister Perkins. Amen. Before I do my prayer, you never know who you may meet along the way. Amen. I had no idea that I would see my nephew here this morning. <laughs> Praise God. Hallelujah. It's just so exciting. God is shouting at all these young people that have come together this morning to have this faith of baptism all the support. Heavenly Father, in the precious name of Jesus, we come to say thank you. We come this morning so grateful, so excited. We know that you are shouting this morning that these parents have come together to have this young person baptized. We thank you so much, God, because they want to in introduce their child to Jesus Christ. We are so thankful that their hearts are wide open today, that their hands are stretched open with love and concern and understanding. And, Father, we're so excited to see all of them come in, just come in and praise you just for a little while for this young man. And then the parents will go on and teach this young person about Jesus Christ. We are just so excited. You know, you don't know God is just shouting this morning. We're ex shouting this morning. We're just so excited. God is just so excited to know that your hearts are open this morning, that your arms are open, your love is open, that you transfer all these good things among one another in a family. And we say to you today, thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you for bringing all of us together. In Jesus' precious name. Hallelujah. Amen, 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 and amen. Amen. Thank you, Minister Perel Chase. Um, we continue with uh, this great celebration as we hear the scripture being read by Malia Williams. Then were they brought unto him little children that he should put his hands on them and pray. The disciples rebuked them, but Jesus said, Suffer little children and forbid them not to come unto me. For such is the kingdom of heaven. And he laid his hands on them and departed them. May the Lord add a blessing to the reading of this word. Amen. 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 Great job, a great job, Malia. Um, you know, God works in a mysterious way, they always say. This morning, I never expected to 
learned that um, Malia, uh, I christened her some time ago and only to meet her again and to have uh, uh, read the scriptures for uh, Josiah. Isn't this amazing? Amen. So God is so good to us. Yes, Amen. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. I just want to build on what has been read um, by Malia, the scripture that was read, to encourage you all who are here, the parents and the godparents, to encourage you. Life is a journey. And on the journey, um, things happen. When Josiah was born, he started his journey, surrounded by lovely parents, whom I met last Saturday and they had a wonderful conversation with them on what it means to nurture a child in Christian faith. It is, it, it is very, very important. And I say this on behalf of Jesus Christ, who knows more than me, what Justin and Loretta are doing already. They are feeding the child. They are clothing the child. They are doing a lot for the child. But we spend time talking about, it's, it's, according to Jesus, it's, there's need for more. It's not only clothing. There's need for one to be nurtured in faith and in spirit. So on the journey that uh, Josiah is walking, here is he being blessed by having parents who are mindful, who know. I did not initiate the christening. It was initiated by the parents who know. And I thank God for them. Because they know. They could have just stayed home, continue to do what they are doing. But I want to say it to you now. Those godparents who are here, and you, the church who is here, and friends who are here, it takes a village to nurture a child. So we are a village. Let's do our best. Let's pray for Josiah. Let's say good words for him too. I, I, I remember... Um, when I was being nurtured by my mother, my, my, my godmother, she said to me, listen, Gladman, as a pastor, don't wash your clergy clothes with your own hands or your what? Take them to the dry cleaner. So, all the time, all the, 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 the clothes that I wear as a pastor, I take them to the clergy. And you know who said that? My godmother. And I'll never forget. My wife washes other things, but not the clothes that I wear for the Lord's work. So please support Josiah with words of encouragement, words of love, words of hope. Please be there for, and last Sunday I told Asbury, let's be there, and I'm glad some members are here, including our lay leader, Sister Peggy Chase, she's here to, to help nature, Josiah. We will, as Asbury, we will make sure that uh, everything that God gave Josiah to impact humankind is fulfilled one day. Who knows what God is calling him to do? May God bless you, village, church, friends. May God bless you. Let's do our best to nurture this blessed child. Amen? Amen. 
Let's pray. Dear Lord, we thank you for the words of Jesus Christ, who invited all the children to come to him, for the kingdom of God is theirs as well. We thank you, God, for the parents of Josiah. We thank you, God, for Josiah. We thank you for the village that is here today, for the church that is here, that is going to nurture him so that he can fulfill your calling. God, we honor you. We praise you. We thank you for the future of this beautiful child. We thank you, God. We are ready to nurture him. We are ready. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. The moment has come for us to Christianize Messiah. Parents and all parents are invited.
I will now invite uh, Sister Peggy Chase to come and offer a prayer. Father God, we thank you for this day, the beauty of this day, the beauty of this opportunity to share in the life of Josiah and his family and his friends. All of us gathered here together, Lord God, create the village that Josiah needs to grow, to be strengthened, and to become the person that you would have him to be. Help us all to live together in peace and harmony. Help us all to always seek you. And we thank you for this short opportunity just to gather here for a few minutes to reflect on you, Lord God, and the life of Josiah. Thank you for all of your blessings, Lord God. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Sister Peggy. 
Before we receive benediction, Malia, may you come forward, please? Amen. I would like to, on behalf of our church, appreciate you all for coming to this great uh, celebration. And uh, I wish uh, Justin and uh, Loretta the best as you nurture this beautiful child. And I look forward to see him one day fulfilling God's calling. And I want to thank you, Village, for coming. Let's continue to be Village. Let's continue to be Village. And um, I also want to appreciate our head usher, Sister Edna Hill, for coming to help us make sure that uh, we follow the <laughs> protocols that need to be followed. And also, I would like to appreciate our communication chairperson, Brother Morris Neal, for the work that he did, believing that everything that we did has been captured for him and for his parents and for the village. Amen, church? May we all stand. Let's pray. Now may the grace of God, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit abide in Josiah and us as we continue this journey until we all enter into eternity. Amen. Amen. Be blessed.